into pain five. Four times they've been knocked down, and four times they have got back up for this moment. Magical journey over Zayas. He likes this one, though. One versus three. He's absorbing so much. The Empress Divide. It comes in, but he's still alive. What? what is going on? Baker Tony's up the first. Everyone's just exploding. What do you think? What do you think? Dude, look at Carrier. He's so happy. It was seven years since their last, a decade since their first. The SKT legacy has been reignited. T1 will be your 2023 world champions. That's never gonna happen again. Four worlds for one player. Even three. Even three. I mean, I can see Barrel winning in one. No. <laughs> no. So, worlds is over. T1 and Faker. They're they're four-time world champions, which is just going to be so difficult for any other individual to replicate. I am I want to say that it will never happen, but records are made to be broken. So maybe there's going to be a point 15, 20 years in the future when someone wins their fifth world championship, or maybe they'll need six or seven if Faker somehow keeps going and wins more. But the fact that Faker in 2013 was the youngest mid laner to ever win a world championship. And that's still true today. There's never been a younger mid laner to win a world championship since Faker did in 2013 at the age of 17. And now Faker's also the oldest player to ever win worlds. The same player from the start of his career to this point in his career is incredible. How do they do it? It happens, let's take advantage. Oh, okay, okay, got you. All right, thanks, man. Predictions? Two on, man, come on. Okay, I just, you never know. How you doing? Good. You look great. Why so excited? Dude, nice to meet you. I heard you used to play a lot of league. Yeah, a little bit, yeah. Yeah, a little oh, bit. A little What's bit? a little bit? 600 hours of a car league. Yeah, that's, yeah. yeah pretty <laughs> I mean, how long have you been watching league? Watching league? Maybe. I think since. 2018, right? 2018. Do you reckon if they don't win, end the T1, as we know it for this roster? 100%. Or I mean, the people were saying that it was the end of this roster like a month ago. Even if they win, I think it's hard to keep them together. Because there's going to be, there's got to be an ego somewhere. Like right now, they're all in the moment, they're all winning. But like, no matter what, if you win with Faker, you're never going to be as legendary as Faker. That is true. Right? And like, let's say Zeus or Karyo or Guma wants to have like their own legacy, like they'll always be second fiddle to Faker no matter what. And for me, as a competitor, yeah. I know that like once you do get that first trophy, and obviously Worlds is the biggest trophy in league, yeah. uh, they've been striving for it for ages, and sure. that's what they've worked their way all this time. If they do get that trophy, uh, let's hope it doesn't change their mental in terms of like what they want next. Yeah. Because uh, they might, step off the gas because you know when you're chasing it mm -hmm. you're mm -hmm. you're not gonna like obviously yeah. put your foot off the pedal but once you've got it you might relax a little and then before you know it you're once again in the, the in the scraps again instead yeah. of at the top you, you have a, a an affiliation to shovel though mm. like you, 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 yeah you want to roof yeah. him a little bit he does i he mean does. he's really good and everyone yeah. names him 24 7. yeah that's why like, i think i relate to him yeah i'm not really good though <laughs> So yeah, <laughs> you do get me. Yeah. Seven worlds, three MSI titles, and people are like, yeah, he's trash. Yeah, some players don't even win any trophy, so I value any trophy that you can yeah. win in league, since there's only two, like, the biggest international yeah. ones. Yeah, absolutely. Like, worlds is obviously worlds. Yeah. But, yeah, if I was a pro, I'd take any trophy I can get. Yeah, uh, yeah show oh, the I faker thing again. The faker, he's the actually... faker jacket. So where did you get office. that? T1 he, office, he's but my a... friend got it yeah. for me. Okay, there's the fit. What about oh, your t-shirt? That's me, I'm, I'm Faker. Yeah. No, I'm what about your t-shirt? My t-shirt? Oh, it's twice. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, new jeans. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Raz! Hey! I'm 
What are you here for? Oh my God. I'm on a TikTok stream. TikTok live? Yes. Yeah. You wanna join? Yes, okay. I will. <laughs> I'll, I'll watch at some point. This is like a really good seat. Man, how wide is that screen? I was watching it from home. Yeah. And so when you saw the, the chance for T1, anytime T1 did literally anything. Yeah. Bar Q, yeah. huge chance. That's like louder than winning game five yes. in the POT series. <laughs> yeah. It was like, here you, he picked Bar. They're like, yes! So yeah. it will be insane if T1 wins. If they're losing, maybe leave early. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that looks amazing. Will there be a mental block for T1? Because, mm. so they've been in uh, five straight regional finals, five straight international events, eight yeah. finals in those 10 tournaments. They've won one <laughs> of eight finals. They've won yeah. one of eight finals. If you include the loser bracket final from MSI, that would be one in nine. Yeah. So there's some yeah. level, across those two and a half years, they've been the best team in the world on average. Yeah. But they always fall at the last Step. Even Rumble in the chat saying, T1 Choker activate. <laughs> that guy's going to get hated on already. I mean, but th that's the fear. No one's talking about it. That's the timer. Do you want these? Yes. I know you're streaming. Yeah. Can I say hi? Yeah, of course. Yeah. Look what we got. Chat. They shy. So I mean, I found the Weibo fans. So. The Weibo fans right here. Yeah. I mean, the big Weibo fan. Yeah. yeah. Thank you for this. All right. Good luck. See you. Kyosik. Oh, hello. Long time no see. Yeah. Yes. Good, good to see you. Good to see you. Who's gonna win? Sorry. Who's gonna win? Uh, I think uh, two, uh, uh, three versus one. Three one? Yeah. Three That's one. what everybody says. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You think three? Uh, I think three one. Yeah. He say, oh, I remember him. Yeah, I remember you. <laughs> World championship last year. Yeah. Uh, three three one. Three oh. Three zero. Okay. Yeah. Showmaker. Three. Oh, yo, three three zero. Three zero. Three two. Two one must win. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. Julius. Oh no! skirmish they're looking for, take the Baron, and from that point on, Weibo doesn't get to fight back. And now one and zero here in the world final. Dude, game one is crazy. Dude, the, I already knew from the draft, like, T1 was going for the biggest skill check of all time yeah. with, like, I mean, the, the Lee Sin, the RA, closer and all, they're just... I thought, Weibo was, I thought Weibo cooked them in that draft and T1 still won. Well, but just think, you were just honestly kind of yeah. useless versus those champs. I thought okay. I thought Weibo's four yeah. five was a little bit. Yeah. Uh, have you thought at all about the fact that you played Weibo and now they're in the finals? Like, do you want them to win? You know, they're, during the opening ceremony, everyone's yeah. like cheering and like hyped and like. Yeah. I'm just like I'm still in like game game mode. I'm just like locked in. Like I I can't like take this trade off still, my face. It's like three weeks later, you're just still locked it's in. It's crazy. Yeah. So I didn't get to talk with you afterwards, but I'm still really proud of what you guys did. Like it's yeah. so amazing. Thank you, thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I'll let you get back to watching worlds though. This is Reaper. Reaper. Good to see you. Who's gonna win? Uh, T1 is gonna be win, obviously. 3-0 now. 3-0, yeah. After game one, because I thought Weibo's draft in game one was like good. Yeah, it was pretty good. Yeah, like, it was very great draft, but T1 won. So. And they still lost in 25 yeah, minutes. It's, exactly. Uh, sweet. Yeah. Yeah. Teddy. Hi. Good to see you yeah, again. Man. Yeah. Good to see you again. I'm nervous about Weibo. I'm nervous okay. about the game. But no one ex. I mean, okay. No one here expects them to win. How many people in China expect them to win? For real? Maybe yeah. only. 
twenty percent, I think. Okay. Maybe only like twenty percent of the audience think we will we, yeah. we will got a chance. Yeah. I've been really looking forward for the shy in this best of five series. Yeah. I mean because really, in my opinion the shy is that type of player that if he can like get the best ship of him, yeah. he can beat Zeus on lane. True. Like he is yeah. the type of player that we, we have a freeze in China like half devil and half angel. Okay. Like like if he, he is on the devil set, he can die like five <laughs> or six or seven times in, in one game. Like we even got a nickname for him. I love that. Uh, that's called Shi Yi Zhua. Okay. Which means uh, the most easiest guy to gank of the whole world. <laughs> yeah, that's called Shi Yi Zhua. Yeah. That's when the shy was on the demon phase. Demon phase. But when the shy was on the angel phase, he will carry his team yeah. all the way through, just like the best of five against BLG. So, yeah. what's the shy gonna do today? Uh -huh. Like, if he gonna be an angel again and save the whole team, or he gonna turn to a demon and ruin the finals. Yeah. Yeah. That's really curious. Jay is playing like his namesake. Oh God, this guy is going crazy in the finals. This is a star. Oh, Timmy, I'm there, man. T1 is already on match point. That was quick. Can they finish it right now, right here? Area is on that sideline. They know he's there. Yeah, he flashes in. He finds himself the job on the four. Is there. Smurfed the fight. Holy fuck. Dude, did you see uh, the teaser? Yeah. That's crazy, no? When, the line itself of like, I, I won three for myself, fourth for my teammates is like. But what about me then? <laughs> what about me? Where's my fourth? I was about to be fourth. Yeah, I was like, so he's standing there, like he didn't play for me, like he didn't play for two. I'm just kidding. He, he played five Galio. And it just feels like a rejuvenated oh. maker. And he goes again. As now Arno looking for that opportunity as well. Oh. It's over, man. It's so it's over. Over. It's so long. That's crazy, man. Trio, trio. They, they swept the LPL. Oh, Baker never lost on his LPL. Overall, you know, this is the first time I've spent significant time in Korea since 2014. And it's just been a really cool journey 12 years after I started my journey into esports. So thanks to everyone for watching, for supporting, to the LCS team, to Worlds, to T1, to Faker, to Energy, to everyone. This has been such a great journey. See you next year.